Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be going back in time and having a look at the Nightmare on Elm Street stickers. I was just traveling along the journey of eBay, just checking out some other stuff on eBay, and uh, I came across these. They were for a fairly reasonable price, granted I only got three of them in the auction, but uh, I thought, yeah, I was going to pick these up and uh, have some fun. Uh, looking at the back here, flipping around. It says, look for the thrill-packed 32-page A Nightmare on Elm Street sticker album today. It gives you a trademark and a copyright date, which I think reads as 1984. I'm looking at the IV and gauging that to be 1984. A fourth new line, Her uh, Heron Venture, all rights reserved, produced by Comic Images, Inc. It gives you the address, yada, yada, yada. So I got three packs, and they are fairly small. They are stickers, after all. But I thought, you know what? I like Nightmare on Elm Street. You like Nightmare on Elm Street. The neighbor's dog loves Nightmare on Elm Street. Let's uh, let's pick these up and have a look at these. And I think uh, if you are wondering, I think the auction might have only been about, I want to say like $12 after shipping and stuff like that. Uh, fairly, inex fairly inexpensive, but I guess if you look at the fact that they are sticker packs, uh, they are vintage though, that's what I really like. Um, I could probably use a knife, but I think I'm going to do this old school. That's what we're all about in these videos, old school. I'm going to open this as if I'm opening this as a child. Now, as a child, I may not have collected A Nightmare on Elm Street because horror movies back then would have scared me. Of course, now as a, as a mature adult, not so much. I love horror movies, especially A Nightmare on Elm Street, uh, you know, Friday 13th and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so... The first sticker that we have is, um, well, it, it doesn't look like necessarily, I'm looking at the back here, it doesn't look like it's actually from the first Nightmare on Elm Street. I guess it maybe is, but I don't remember this particular scene from the original Nightmare on Elm Street. Let's flip it around here. Uh, Want to look just like Freddy? Get the Freddy rubber mask and hat set. One size fits all, regularly $19.95, now just $18.95 with a three-pack sticker uh, wrappers. Ah, it's a, sh it's a shill for some more stuff that you can buy. Uh, you can go to Comic Images. Uh, please add $1.95 postage and handling. Allow four to six weeks for delivery. I could probably assure you that this such a thing does not exist anymore. Uh, the imaging actually does kind of look a little bit like uh, perhaps a Nightmare on Elm Street Part Three, but as you can see, I guess it's just more so an advertisement for a post for uh, for a hat and uh, rubber mask and hat set. And I guess that's not too bad. Eighteen ninety five with three sticker pack wrappers. I technically have three sticker pack wrappers. What I don't have though is the seventy five thousand dollars to pay for a time machine to go back in time and mail this. I'd be curious to know if I could actually find the hat and mask on eBay. I wonder if such a thing exists. If they have, they're probably long since gone. Uh, the next one we have, so again, like I don't think these are all Nightmare on Elm Streets because that's Nightmare on Elm Street 2 right there. Here we have Nancy holding the fedora of Freddy Krueger. This is number 54, Freddy's Greatest Hits. How about some Freddy music to keep you from sleeping? Night Nine Nightmare songs can be yours for just... My God, they just keep churning out. Next is going to be like Freddy Krueger pajamas. Nightmare on Elm Street uh, sleep set. How about a Freddy Krueger spoon that laughs at you while you're eating your cereal? How about some Freddy music, though? Nine Nightmare songs to be yours for just $6.95 and two sticker pack wrappers. Comic images, once again, please add $1.95 postage and handling. Allow four to six weeks for delivery. Yada, yada, yada. I suppose it's not so bad because, I mean, these are stickers. You're going to be putting them into a sticker album. You're really not going to see the back anyways. You're going to peel those off. Again, this could be necessarily then A Nightmare on Elm Street Part 3. Possibly. Uh, next one we have is this one right here. It's that girl from Nightmare on Elm Street 2. 
which so again like all the back of it here is just shameless plugging i think we've established that now shameless plugging a nightmare on elm street companion a behind the scenes guide book look at the terrifying movie series it's just 9.99 regularly it's 10.95 with two sticker pack wrappers again none of these you could probably acquire now uh let's again look at the movie looks like the mom from a nightmare on elm street the very first one there's the back right there Oop. Flip it around. Number 90, uh, 76. Again, the numbers aren't really going to help you because when you put, put them into your album, well, you're not going to see it. Uh, need to stay awake. Play the game to end all games. Will you get Freddy or will he get you? Send $22.95, regularly $24.95. It says regularly. I don't know who's to gauge whether that's right or not. They could just be saying anything. It's regularly $145. You can get it, though, for $7. That's a deal I wouldn't want to miss out on. Once again, you can go to Comic Images, Saddlebrook, New Jersey, 07662. Here we have Jesse from A Nightmare on Elm Street Part 2. Which I guess really, now if I'm looking at the packs here, uh, it couldn't possibly be. Maybe it's 94. XXX. Anybody know? I'm going to probably have to look this up. I'm going to have to probably look this up. You know what? I'm going to do this right now. I don't want to be that guy. I do not want to be that. I don't want to be that guy that doesn't know. So I'm going to look this up on my phone currently during the review. We're going to look this up right now. I'm going to find out so that I know so that you guys don't say, hey, how did he not know Roman numerals? Well, we're going to do that right now. Uh, let's do this. Okay, so MCM, right? L, X, 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 I, V, right? M-C-M-L-X-X-X-I-V. I'm going to look that up. I'm going to find out what that is. That is 1984. Roman numerals. M-C-M-L-X-X-X-I-V is 1984. It seems like that shouldn't be right, but that's what I'm going with. That's, that's what's there. Yay, research. Okay, so let's go ahead. Resume where we left off. Here we have Jesse. Having a bad dream, I'm sure. From Nightmare on Elm Street Part 2. Freddy's Revenge. What's the advertisement for this one? Freddy's Greatest Hits. More Freddy's Greatest Hits. Okay. Here's a sticker from Nightmare on Elm Street Part 3. King Cade. Ripping apart a chair. That's how you show real strength. Well done, King Cade. Well done. The back of it. This is number 205. Once again, advertising Freddy's Greatest Hits. So I guess there weren't many things that they could advertise for this sticker set. So that's sticker pack one. Let's grab sticker pack two. As you can see, they are small stickers, so. Oh, hello. Hello, nurse. From Nightmare, and, and actually that looks like that should combine with something. Not quite this one, as you can see, but you can see how the, it has no border to it. So like Jesse is here, and nurse from uh, Nightmare on Elm Street part three, it's not quite, you know, it's not the same scene, obviously, but you can see how they're halved. I wonder what would be like over here. You know, I don't know. There's Jesse anyways. Poor Jesse. The damsel, the damsel in distress. What are we advertising on the back here? I want to look just like Freddy. Okay, that's the mask and hat set. This one here is the officially licensed adjustable, bendable, soft plastic blades. That's a mouthful. Just sent $18.95. Wouldn't you know it, that's not the regular price. $19.95 was the regular price with three sticker pack wrappers. Send that to Comic Images. Next we have... That is uh, the girl from A Nightmare on Elm Street, the first Nightmare on Elm Street. About to be zipped up in the body bag. And it's advertising Freddy's Greatest Hits, okay. What's this one? Is this the Wizard Master? Possibly. I don't know. On the back, I can tell you, though, it's advertising the Nightmare on Elm Street street game. Need to stay awake? Play the game to end all games. The Nightmare on Elm Street street game. We looked at this already. Twenty two ninety five. dollars Chill, chill, chill. That looks like Jesse screaming. That's basically most of the movie. He's screaming like a girl. Uh, on the back, special for Freddy fans, Nightmare on Elm Street companion. More money. I certainly would not have had this sort of money back in the day. I mean, 
newspaper route or not, that's money I would not have had. Next we have the Melting Away Freddy from A Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge, near the end of the movie. Apparently used wax. Just put ho uh, hair dryers on it. Who would have thought it? That's practical effects. Not that crap CG that we use for everything nowadays. Practical effects, that's where it's at. Let's look at the last wrapper, last sticker pack. And I think so far we've gotten no doubles, which is good. Uh, I'm assuming this is Freddy dressed in his tuxedo. I mean, without the other half of the card, I have absolutely... I'm, that's what I'm going with. It, it looks like him, if I could gauge it only by the shoulder. This one is no idea. Oh, it looks like it fits... Well, it's four together, right? Maybe it's Freddy coming out of the bed, and there's feathers from the bed, possibly. I'm going to go with that. Uh, this one. Wow, this one is really difficult. It's number 172. I don't even know if it goes like this. This, this. I have no idea. That one I draw a blank at. Uh, it looks like Jesse. The bottom half of Jesse, that is. Uh, we've got that guy who liked puppets and stuff from Nightmare on Elm Street 3. I guess that's what it looks like to me. His tendons and stuff are all coming out of his wrists, Freddy's, you know. And uh, lastly, we got Nightmare on Elm Street. He's being arrested. He didn't kill her. It was Freddy. Freddy did that. And uh, this is number 26, a special for Freddy fans, Nightmare on Elm Street companion. Once again, shill, shill, shills, $9.99, regularly $10.95. An interesting take on stickers. I don't think one of the greatest stickers you could possibly get, but I guess it would be a little bit more important if you had the sticker album, which unfortunately the person selling this auction did not have. The person buying the auction, like myself, didn't have either. So we only have stickers to go by, but some fun stickers nonetheless, apparently from 1984. Today we were going back in time and having a look at A Nightmare on Elm Street stickers. Six stickers inside, no doubles, that's good. And we got a total of 18 stickers. That's six times three. That's simple math. If you guys like this video, certainly hit it with a like down below. Would you like to see more retro videos on this channel? Let me know down below in the comments section. And if you haven't had a chance to hit that little bell notification, what are you waiting for? Uh, turn on that little bell, hit your little notification button, or turn it on at least, and then you'll be notified when new videos on this channel are coming on. And then you'll you'll never be that person that says, hey, I didn't know you reviewed this till months later they find the video. I didn't know you reviewed this. Yeah, notification was turned off. You can thank YouTube for that. As always, guys, thanks for watching as you always do. I'll see you next time.